In this video, I'm gonna show you two dropshipping products that are currently selling really well on Facebook. So one of the hardest challenges when it comes to starting a dropshipping business is getting that initial traction with a product. Even then, they tend to be kind of stereotypical dropshipping products. They tend to be trending products, products that kind of spike massively in popularity during certain seasons. So for example, if the weather's warmer, if the nights are longer, that sort of thing, to then completely fall off a cliff and become almost non-existent for the next six months until they come back into trend. The products I'm gonna show you in this video are not like that. Both of these products are consistent sellers all year round. So if you are looking for a consistent seller, something to bring a consistent flow of income into your business, then I'm gonna show you two great products. So the first one I'm gonna show you is called Secure Mat. The typical format of these videos then is I'll show you the products and the ad creative so you know exactly what it takes to sell one of these products successfully. I'll also point out the sorts of things that you might not be aware of, little things that the businesses might be doing to help kind of separate themselves from competition um, and encourage the success of their business. So these guys have been selling this product since August of 2021. That's quite a few years. As you can see, it is a shower mat. I'll play this in the background for you shower mats don't tend to come into season regardless of what time of year it is people have a requirement for this thing sort of thing so it will sell 12 months through the year it has 32,000 reactions, 8,500 comments, and 10,000 shares. It has a pretty significant amount of engagements, and there's kind of like indicator number one that it's doing really, really well. A post doesn't get that level of engagement, this level of viewership, unless either they're a famous influencer or they're paying a significant amount of money to, to boost this, to put it out there to an audience. The way I know that these are still current and active and working is if we take a look at the comment section. So 22 hours ago, two days, one day, one day, one day, three days, three days, one day, three days. Um, this one is a year old, probably because it has a recent one. No, so I'm not sure why Facebook does this, but every now and again, it puts like a really old comment up there. But three days, four days, four days, as you can see, significant amount of comments all within the last seven days, which is a great sign. It shows it's still working. The other thing I'm looking for before we go back to the ad creative, is intent to buy the product or actually people given the amount of comments this has there should be quite a few people um, in the comment section that have said they've bought this thing so i need this took off every day after shower and hung up so it looks like karen has one of these um, i like to take bass turn out to slip i love mine so judith's got one of these things um, amanda love mine let's keep going see if we can find anything else these mats are great so that would indicate that kathy has one as you can see i'm not sure if you will have been seeing in fact but if you check out the profile pictures of the people who are interested in this product um, they tend to be people of an older generation given my experience now advertising on facebook for the past seven years then it does tend to be females over the age of like 50 plus that tend to be the best buyers and this would be proven true if we take a look at some of the profile pictures of the people who are commenting about this thing so i have one i have one too oh i have one too I think she has one. I think she's missed about two there. Anyway, um, I've used one of these for several years. Um, a normal doormat will suffice, apparently. Um, best shower bath mats we've ever had. We have two in our bathrooms. These mats are for real. Love mine. I have one. I've had mine for about a year. I love mine. It's perfect. I love mine. I love mine. I love mine. How much does it cost? As you can see, lots and lots of people are buying this product. So I think there's no two ways about it. People are buying this thing. By the sounds of it, they're focusing on a US market as well. Let's play this in the background so you can see what it looks like. By the sounds of it though, I'll just talk while this plays, is three days shipping on all US orders. So that would indicate they're targeting. And the fact that it said Americans there as well, I think it was a quarter of a million Americans slip on a wet bathroom floor every day. So it looks like the US is their main target market. Things that sell well in the US are gonna sell well in Australia. They're gonna sell well in the UK. They're gonna sell well pretty much across the globe. So if you're watching this video from any other country, then maybe you wanna look into um, being one of the, or taking this product and selling it to one of those other countries. They do a really good job when it comes to the ad creative. It all looks like original content. There's no like Chinese actors or blurred out parts it all looks like they've gone to the extent to film proper content with real people as you can see showing all of the different kind of real life use or real use life cases um, for this product so all in all they do a really really good job let's jump onto the website then say and see what it takes to sell this on a shopify store so this is not a typical format setup as you can see like you would see on a normal e-commerce site it's kind of like a funnel there's lots and lots of information about the product i've not actually seen this site before so usually i look at the sites before i do these videos this is the first time seeing this one 
and I didn't expect this. To me, this is almost a bit overkill. Let's try and click get yours. So it's almost like an extra layer before you actually get to the point in which you can add it to cart and buy it. The other thing to notice as well is look how block, look at the block fonts they're using it and how big it is on the page. They're clearly targeting an older generation here. People that are 60, 70 years old, their eyesight typically isn't as good as somebody, say my age, even though I have terrible eyesight. So they're, everything is designed and set up to accommodate for people of an older generation where their eyesight might not be as good, apart from the reviews by the looks of it, um, which have gone down to the typical kind of like 10 or 12 size font. So they're selling the product for $29. Um, you can buy more than one of these things to get a discount. It is the sort of thing where people probably have more than one bathroom, um, so they probably will be buying two or three of these things. Let's jump on to AliExpress then and see how much roughly it's going to be. So 12 euros equates into about, what, 13 14 dollars, I think. They're selling it for $30, so there's a 100% markup there, just simply doubling the price. This one is a 60 by 60. This one is a rectangular one, so there are two different sizes and it is slightly more expensive for the bigger one as well. So there and all, it gives you kind of like a rough ballpark figure of what your profit margins are going to be. And it's definitely a plausible product and one that is obviously working for these guys. Where these guys kind of separate themselves from the competition is the fact they have a stock of them in the US so they can offer fast shipping. Instantly that separates them apart from any other dropshippers out there wanting to sell this product. So always, always, always try and source local. And the other thing as well is the branding. Everything is super, super branding from the color schemes to the fonts to the ad creatives, any piece of content you see on here by the looks of it has been created specifically for this website. And again, it just does a really nice job of, it's obvious what these guys do. So one of the biggest things I see when I'm reviewing other people's Shopify stores is they, they try and sell everything to everybody, but you wanna be super, super specific about who your target market is and gear everything towards them. If you just have a really generic site that, has lots of different products on, lots of different fonts, lots of different styles of images. And um, what I mean by that is you'll have like Chinese imported images from AliExpress versus original images. If everything is mismatched and not very uniform, and then it doesn't do a very good job. If you like that product and you like my way of kind of analyzing and breaking down um, how to find those winning products, then I think you'll really like this. So it's 100% free, by the way. I'm not gonna try and sell you anything. You don't need your credit card, nothing like that. There's absolutely no BS involved, I'm guaranteed. You literally put your name in, put your email address in, and two minutes later, this will be in your inbox. Um, this is 127, a PDF put together by myself of products just like the one I showed you, validated in the exact same way, 127, any products for 2024 so it will basically remove any need to do any product research for the next 12 months because you've got 127 different ideas to choose from if you want to grab yourself a copy of this top link in the video description below let's get back to the video moving on to a company called flexstrap brilliant brilliant business um I'll show you their Shopify store in a second. Um, but again, they do a super, super good job of really branding and taking ownership of the product. This is a product that you can buy on AliExpress Look for pennies, for literally one euro plus shipping is 186. So three or four dollars this product is delivered. And yet they do such a good job of advertising it and the perceived value of this product. So that's kind of like, that's the way of hooking people in so it's a statement of chiropractors don't want you to know this and given what's happening there it's going to hook and suck people in because they want to watch it oh what a chiropractor is trying to hide um that sort of thing it's all geared and targeted towards again that ideal target market of a slightly older generation and the uh, where is it? So 90% of lower back pain comes from tight glutes, hamstrings, and hip flexors. And then they've got their buzzwords there. So chronic back pain, sciatica is a buzzword, limited mobility. So anybody experience these sorts of things when they see these keywords, these buzzwords, instantly they're going to take notice. They're quoting a doctor there. I use Flexstrap and was so impressed that I recommend it to my patients. So everything is just kind of geared around social proof. Everything is branded as well. I don't know if you saw the video. Let's bring this up. So this has 14 million views, which is um, pretty incredible. Let me see if I can find the clip for you. Or oh, maybe not. There was a clip, I'm sure of it. There was a clip of somebody moving the product with the actual logo on it. I'll show you on the website instead. So in fact, let's go back and check out the comment sections as well. So you wanna make sure that obviously people are buying this thing. So 10,000 reactions, four and a half thousand comments, nearly 2000 shares. That other products I showed you, 
had 10,000 shares. So that probably has more like 30 million views, which is crazy. Um, so lots and lots of comments. These ones are pretty old, um, but I'll show you the most recent ones in a second. So got one, I'm interested, I've just ordered mine. I've just ordered mine. I suffer from hip and lower back pain. Uh, stretching daily, let's see what else we can find. I think I'll get one of these. Is it good for sciatica? Lots and lots of people showing interest. Not so many people saying they have one, but there are a few people saying that they're interested and that they've got one like this person here. Let's go ahead though and check out the newest. So once this loads up, so three days ago, this 43 weeks, so I don't get why that one goes to the top, but three days, three days, five days, six days, one week, two week, two weeks, three weeks. So it's again, it's not the sort of thing that's gonna spike massively in popularity and then fall off a cliff it's going to be a consistent seller all year round potentially selling slightly better during the colder months when people tend to be a bit stiffer let's jump onto the website then so this is a clip the image um, i was looking for so it comes in its very own branded bag again this instantly sets these guys apart from any other dropship out there for you to compete with these guys then you're gonna to have to invest a bit more money than you would into just a standard typical stereotypical dropshipping business because not everybody's gonna to go to the length of getting their logo printed on the products because it's an extra financial investment into the business and an extra risk but what it does is help separate them apart from anyone else selling the product which means they're much more likely to kind of win the purchase um, for anybody who's looking for this sort of product so it's called the flex strap and straight away into a testimonial scared of surgery I gave this device a shot for my lower back pain and sciatica in just eight days the pain disappeared i even had an x-ray my bulging discs were back to normal so that is a very very strong claim lots and lots of more social proof with the reviews 249 reviews everything is very minimalistic using the same fonts um and again everything as you can see with the greens so even in the product images everything kind of matches to the color schemes they're using on the site as well so how there's a video as well that comes with it which is a nice little touch where they're using the greens for the ticks and the greens for the icons and i'm sure if we come down so the greens 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 everything is branded super super nicely you can tell whoever made this website knows exactly what they're doing um, and all in all just well put together with tons and tons of information custom icons again not the sort of thing you would see on a typical dropshipping store in order to be successful at this now you have to be willing to do what other people aren't and most people are lazy. Most people just throw a Shopify store together, import some products from AliExpress, get some really cheap ad creatives made up. They won't hire actors. There won't be any social proof. There won't be any original content and they'll just hope for the best. But if you're doing the same as everybody else and you're not separating yourself from the competition, then you're gonna get the same results as everybody else. And the harsh reality is that most people um, fail when it comes to starting a dropshipping business. And that being said, if you don't wanna be one of those people that ends up failing and becoming just another percentage, um, then you need to get some guidance you need to get some help from somebody who has experience and preferably a mentor if that is the sort of thing you're interested in then what I want to do is invite you to have a free Google meet call with myself we can jump on a call together get to know each other see if we like the idea of working with each other um, I can get to know kind of like what your current level of experience is what you want to achieve in the next few months um, and then see ultimately if I can be the person to help you get there if that sounds good to you then what you need to do is come below this YouTube video that you're watching come into the description which is this gray box here um, and then at the bottom click this secret call link the reason it's a secret link at the bottom and i'm only telling you about this now is because i only want to work with people who are serious about committing themselves and being proactive about starting a dropshipping business to put it at the beginning of the video it everybody would see that and i don't want everybody booking in a call it wastes my time i only want to work with people who like i said are serious and the fact that you've watched the video all this way through um then it shows me that you probably are so if that is you go through this um, 163 people have been through it so it's a super short it takes a couple of minutes and like i said it's just a basically a preemptor to the call a chance for me to kind of see what level you're currently at um see if i can be the person to get there and if i can or think i can then we can jump on a call together um, and have a chat and see if it's going to work out. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Um, have an awesome day. I'll see you in the next one.